Hi guys, this is Martin, aka Martin the Vlogger, and this channel is everything about riding, fun, and petrol helmet. And I have here my buddy. His name is Pavel, but we need to find him a name for this YouTube channel. He's gonna, if we will agree, he will be running a tour and rental agency with me. He will be helping me. So, Pavel. Hey, what's up, guys? I think I will call you Mr. P. <laughs> Sound like peeing, going to the toilet. No, we cannot use these words on the YouTube. So, uh, what's the what's the video today about? Well, Polly, Mr. P, will rent the Riker today. He, have you ever rode the Riker? No, never. Have well, you ever rode the Beast? Once, a little bit. No, he was not riding. Five he was, minutes. He was he was just going five meters <laughs> to the front and seven meters to the back. So, what's this going to be all about? I'm gonna quickly tell you, like to a newbie, like what's this all about? And you're gonna do like 1000 kilometers, right? Hopefully. And you are not aware of this, but I'm gonna give you beast on one twisty road and I'm gonna be chasing you on this thing. And you're gonna tell me, as a newbie, what is the difference and how do you feel between F3 as the beast and the Riker? So guys, Enough of this, let's get started. All right, man. So what would you like to know is if you are riding it for the first time, just as a normal guy that rents the bike, what would you like to know about it? Tell me. Like, you know how to position the yes. foot packs. Yeah. It was quite easy. Maybe. You know how to position these things. That's easy. That's good. That's okay. the difference between the Spider and the Riker. You can, you can change that. You're going to have a heated things. You need to just press it longer here. Okay. They're off the market. It's called Daytona. Press it longer, they will start heating. Just okay. tell me because I never have them on. Just tell me how they are. Try everything out. My first task, and actually this is, take it as a part of the test for you, if you will be able to work with me or not. Like this is adjustable windshield. It should be adjustable. So without breaking it, try to, because you're gonna have the bike for several days without me, try to figure it out how to, because it should be possible to, to race it a little Somehow. bit. Somehow. Yeah. And it should be just clip, you know, like this. But I don't know how it works. It's gonna be up to you. Uh, you have new springs. This video is about the installation. You have a new exhaust. You know what? Actually, start it. Go, go ahead and start it. Okay. Uh, do I think that? Yeah. There is the key. Actually, the key. here you get a key. Okay. Without this, it doesn't work. Okay. And. This video is actually the same one if the, somebody would like to steal your bike is like try to figure it out like how to start Let's it. see if I can do it. I've never yeah. done it before. Yeah. Okay. Alright. <laughs> okay, that's, that's obvious. There you okay. go. Good. It's one on. Thing. Almost there. Okay, what does it do now? Let's see. I should read something but Maybe, no, maybe okay. later, maybe later, okay? What well, now, what do we do? Let's try to start it. Well, it's on! So easy! Alright. How did you know that you need to do this? Uh, I think I've seen it somewhere. Oh, some, cheating, some, cheating, cheating, ah! cheating. So what do you think about the exhaust? I didn't expect that. <laughs> it was way too louder and it was way too like massive. And like, do you, do you know how heavy is the stock exhaust? Say like nine kilograms. Like ten. ten? It's right over there. Yeah, let's see. yeah, I just did a comparison and it's like it's crazy. No, you have got back problems. It's super heavy. That's how to lift with the back problem. Yeah. <laughs> he's he's old. He just looks young, but he's old, you know. <laughs> you know you got a you got a tank here. Yeah. And actually, I don't like this because there is no kind of protection against water. Yes. I know there is kind of a security system, but we need Isn't to figure it out from the bottom. We, no, there is nothing from the bottom, and we will figure it out something at MTV show because from my like just the feeling I don't like it so we will figure it out something you got a because you're elder guy you're gonna have special seat. special seats you know so that's fine there is some kind of symbol so you, that you should wait like five seconds when you are refilling okay right. something like on my car you have a brake right over there yeah 
you have a throttle here. There is no pedal box now, but it will be there, so we will do that. Uh, you have extra lights here. You have uh, high beams, low beams, that's all fine. Okay. Uh, I told you about shocks. Yeah. Uh, we need to check the tire pressure, that's what we're gonna do okay. later. And basic, oh, oh yeah, and you have the shed saddlebags. Oh, good. The same ones as I have, that, that okay. should be the same. Yeah. So, you should be all good to go, right? Yeah. Okay, doke. So, see you basically in about 500 kilometers. You have like, like we did like how many, like 300 kilometers, something, something like, that. like that. Yeah. So what do you think about Riker so far? It is nice. It's a bit crazy. What is your like, like really like impression? Like, uh, is it safe? It's very safe. Safe. Even if you like speed into the curves, yeah, you, know, you just you know release the throttle and you know the response is very nice. But but you said like we still need to do the sway bar because you are all yes, over the yes. place on Jump, the bumpy roads. Yes, it's a little bit jumping because we you change the springs and it's much harder on on the wheels. But uh, the steering and the front needs a little bit of yeah tune. But so we will do, we will do definitely a sway bar as I, as I promised. You know how to change how to do the windshield, right? Yeah. It's easy. It's, maybe you're gonna be higher. Let yeah. me see. Let me see. Just Let me see. Now it's up. See slowly. Like, like. You like need this. to push it. Yeah. And then. From All right. The I was I was just dummy. Maybe yeah. I will disc. I will cut this off out from the video. <laughs> what about the exhaust? Too loud? Because it doesn't have a neutral. And, and you, you're not shifting. You're Some, not it's shifting. It's, so it's on the highway can be annoying. It is, it is, but people can hear you, so they know you're coming around. Oh man, I can hear you. But I can hear him, even I have the beast, I can hear you. Yeah. Even through the beast. Well, now, we will talk later, because tomorrow we have like another, yeah. like 400 kilometers or something. But today, maybe some people will get jealous. Polly, Mr. P, you, you're going there, you're going on the beast. Right, the beast. And I would like to hear what's the... What's gonna be the impression? Because he's always telling me like, the beast is much faster, it's much stable. It's about the rider. <laughs> Just by the way, I forgot to tell you. I got the racing brakes, so they are cold. They will not break, so you need to heat them up. Two, I got a pedal box. So yeah. the throttle is gonna be like super sharp and I'll just put it into city because I don't want to get my, the beast wasted and Remaining part, it's just, again, about a rider, you know? So tell me. This thing is a piece of a crazy shit. <laughs> it was reacting quickly. The response was perfect. It helps you when you don't know how to shift, the undershift sometimes. It went like a rocket. 
and, I, and I had to head it in the smoothest mode. Yeah, yeah. Rather we turn off the the pedal box because I was heavy from the Riker on the on 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 the throttle. Yeah. yeah, it was too much. But this thing handles like like butter. Very nice. It's it's a weird feeling to see the beast uh, in front of you from behind. Yeah. <laughs> But it sounds amazing though. It really sounds amazing. And it's fat, it's badass. It is. It is I, I don't know where it was the last. I even don't know if I have really gave it to anyone and I was riding behind. First time. Didn't, just, didn't destroy, yeah. didn't crash. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks God. <laughs> oh, and I have to say, like after really switching directly from one bike to another, uh, it doesn't really fly and i was you know like chasing him it's more about he needs to get used to it i mean he needs to get like if you're a first time on a three-wheeler and he's really like motorbike rider you need to adjust you know it, it, it you need to trust the bike because there is a lot of stability and a lot of security and for me the difference that thing is just super like it's really the beast this one even though it's a riker I feel like more relaxed. Son of a beast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it's really like relaxed and you know, it can go. I was able to follow him even though he was not really yeah. super fast, but it's more like, you know, I still think it's more cruise. And you are sitting right in the bike. Yeah. That's the biggest difference. You are in the bike, you are on the top of a rocket. Yep. in the studio it's very messy in here and actually I even don't know if I have finished the video with Mr. P or not uh, the situation is that I'm super 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 busy anyway in the meantime I have rented out the Riker and I can tell you this experience I have rented it out to my good friend and his girlfriend And she went for a ride, came back. She never rode a single lane motorbike. She never rode Riker. She never rode Spider. She was just only a two-up person with uh, with his with her boyfriend. And she ended up next day. She ended up buying a new Riker for herself. Uh, that's how cool these bikes are. Stay tuned because many things are happening. Stay tuned because spikes for the Spider for the moment. Uh, the inner, basically, inside caps for wheels are coming and I will be making videos about them. I'm working also on Riker spikes. Uh, they're gonna be super cool. So stay tuned on that. Next week, I'm gonna pick up a new Riker because uh, the second one is coming for the tour agency. Another two are booked. All of them I will be loading uh, with many accessories during the winter time. So a lot of things to do. Exhaust, still need to test and do some reviews and do some additional things with RLS. New stuff is coming to the shop. We will be opening, like, I will take out the wall because I have rented another plot. So many things. So stay tuned, guys. Subscribe, like, dislike, do whatever. But most importantly, guys, most importantly, remember, always have fun.